We bout to play 2K Brutal Sim, step back J Kobe got that clutch, throw it up That's game, I'm going through the lane Russell Westbrook, quickness Woodoop Woodoop It's your boy You don't know Brutal Simone C Wicked and Mean with a next video for y'all man so we back in tutorial mode man you know how it is man before we start anything we gotta give a salute to Bruce Squad Bruce Squad stand up we in the building y'all we pushing to that 100k right now man and we pushing heavy man I do appreciate every one of y'all 110% anyone that hit that notification y'all know how it is anyone that hit the notification bell just put Bruce Squad in the comments bro y'all know I be in the comments and I ain't going front every time I see that Bruce Squad my eyes just draw to it y'all alright Bruce Squad official man I do appreciate y'all 110% for all the love man alright so right now I bring a defensive tutorial for y'all man a lot of people been asking me about this um I ain't going front I came from my career I grind my career to get like grind to get the 99 y'all know that y'all been following me y'all been on my live streams man on twitch of course I'm plugging it man I'm twitching every day so come true but anyways man um y'all been with me right so y'all see I've been on my career now when I was done getting that 99 it was time for me to hit the parks because you know my next goal was to get that elite 3 as y'all see right there but in my journey I know this I was trash at defense bro like I had one of the quickest players in the game in the game one of the fastest players and I was trash people was running circles around me and then I know it's like I was playing with Sid um Sid 6 7 right and he was playing great defense bro. he had a playmaking shot creator and I noticed what he was in. I'm a very uh, if y'all don't know man about me I pick up something about from everyone I play with their strengths I usually I'm very good at observing and learning and going and figuring out myself I didn't ask him how he was playing defense but I was really focusing on what he was doing and I'm focusing on what the better defenders that defend against me who is a I got a pure point forward very fast very good ball handler of course I could make my own shot anytime I could just get buckets running circles around anyone but I started noticing certain things that the people who were doing the better things to defend against me like people who were constantly stopping me or slowing me down a little bit right like for example crowding my dribble a lot um, a lot of people are crowding my dribble and stuff like that right so I started like okay so this is what you do against the faster builds and this is what slows me down and then I start applying it to my game right someone found me in the back I'm always trying to hide some people's people are looking for me they found me but anyways all right, now I'm going to show you all. I'm going to give you all, all the tools to play defense on the faster builds in NBA 2K19. The quicker builds. All these playmaking sharps, the playmaking shot creators, the pure playmakers, the pure point forward. But, let me put out this disclaimer. Once you reach up on someone that knows what you're doing, if he's crafting us, he could get away from this defense. But this is by far the best way to play these builds. 110 percent and i'm not addressing screens in this video or team defense because screens and team v defense go hand in hand this is man to man mano in mano defensive tutorial right so let's get through the details man i know that intro is long man but it's very good and you know i like really giving the backstory to what draw me to doing this man all right now first thing first you all need to do right here is go into the options and go into control the settings the first thing control the sentence because i'm giving you all, all the tools right and i need you all to go to the defensive uh part right here right post pro stick defense and then switch it to absolute this is a must and leave who to guard you cannot play without who to guard right leave who to guard and make sure and put pro stick defense on absolute now the next thing i need you all to do is go into 2k youtube or oh, y'all might not need to do it because I'm doing it right here for y'all. But this is very important. 2K giving y'all a lot of tools right here. A lot of tools. And what I observe, right? Let me go to defense real quick. What I observe, that to slow me down, to slow me down as a pure point forward or pure playmaker, same difference. 
or to slow down the um, play sharps and to slow down um, all these very fast ball handling builds pretty much any build with a ball right you could use this strategy if it works for the faster ball handlers right and you got a crowd you got to crowd the ball handler you have to crowd the ball handler right so the crowd dribbler when playing defense of course you gotta this this left trigger right here is very very essential this is extremely essential for playing um when you when it comes to you just crowding the dribble now next thing you need to look at is the intense d you see right there what again what is intense d the left trigger it's the same thing it's the same thing right so crowd the dribbler is very important the next thing you all need to learn is a fast shuffle now i use this all the time right now i ain't going front especially right now i'm forcing myself to play a little full court press on the faster bills of course now if they get past me i'm yelling help help of course you got to play with smart teammates and then you switch the hills right but most of the time i'm very successful especially with the smaller builds because i'm much bigger and stronger of course and of course the fast this fast shuffle helps me stay in front of a lot of builds man i ain't gonna lie to you all right so to do the fast shuffle of course you press the hold down the two triggers man while you move with the left stick you see it right there now the next thing you gotta know is the hands up y'all this is why you you, know, you put the um pro stick defense to absolute so you could always push the right stick up and i know a lot of point guards out there i see a lot of youtubers say yo i hate people that play hands up no that's the smartest defense now if you combine that with the fast shuffle right you don't always hold up the hands up but you combine that with the fast shuffle when they're about you gotta be very very brand you gotta be on point when you're playing these fast defenders because a simple snapback gonna gonna break your ankles you know that and the only thing that saves you from that is the hands up the hands up or the bump the crowd the dribble these are the two things that saves you but i snap ankles with people hands up as well man so it only works for so much depending on how crafty the dribbler is but it's definitely an ankle saver right here now these are the three things you need man these are the three essentials you need at all times when playing defense in this game right now i'm gonna go and show you all some examples and explain to you all how to execute these three essential things right here these are what you need now some people use the hands out instead of the hands up this works as well to save your ankles right you could actually use this as well to save your ankles now as i said let's now go let's now go to the examples so I could break it down for your 100. I told y'all, as soon as we're done with this video, yo, your defense is gonna improve 110%, man. So let's get to the video. Okay, here's an example of me playing full court press right now, man. I noticed that I step up on him and check that up. Bump. Bump. Now all this is the left trigger at work right here. Now you don't want to necessarily hold it down all the time, yo, but as soon as you're about to make contact with the player you tap the left trigger man all right but to slide don't get it wrong to slide you gotta hold down both left and right triggers i want you all to check this out again in slow motion what's going on here man a lot is going on here now at the beginning i'm trying to bump him with the left trigger right all right i'm up on him tight i'm sliding holding down the left and right triggers of course to slide and keep bumping him keep bumping him so basically i'm smothering him of course um he's trying to get open he can't because i keep bumping him as soon as he gets close right this is all left trigger and right trigger and moving the um left stick in the direction now here i'm a little late i ran back hands up of course and definitely the best way to close out is as soon as you close and out hold down the left trigger right and then here it is he actually beat me in a position i release it i sprint over then tap the left trigger to make that contact the left trigger actually gives you a nice close out as well if you all didn't know he's not going to get you out of position as soon as you reach close to him just tap that left trigger you see as i release and start sprinting towards him i released it don't forget that at all man and check out this next example here i'm, I'm gonna approach him and i'll tell you all i've been challenging myself lately to play a lot more man to man tight defense on players bro and be more aggressive on defense and it's all about that left trigger bump that left bump trigger. now if you notice on that play right there right 
I'm out of position because my teammate did not switch. I want you all to take a look at that again. Right, check out this play right here. Where I'm playing full defense, I'm playing really good until the time where I needed to switch right here. Check me bump him. I'm going to bump him again. And then they're going to be across. Then I'm going to step up. I'm going to play help defense when my teammate didn't help. But what I did, I actually timed the pass because I know I can't run back to play defense. So I timed the pass and then I pressed steal, right, to try to tip a pass or something like that, right. Now check out this next play right here as well. Now this is a much quicker dude full court. Now look at the timing on the steal. As soon as he did the size up, that's when I went for the steal, man. I'm going to show it to you all again in slow motion. Now I need you all to look at the bump, right. Look at the bump and look when I went for the steal. Not right as he got bumped, but as soon as he did the size up wait as soon as he had to do the size up right there that's it that's when i went for the steal right so as i said man this is the new strategy i've been using lately i've been way more aggressive on defense man I'm using that left trigger to bump people um using the right stick to avoid your ankles being broken by pushing it up or holding it left or right and knowing when to um actually use the steal now in this play right here i actually shoved the player out of bounds by using that bump right now check it out right here as soon as he about to push to the right hit that bump shove him out of bounds man now let me show you again in slow motion but with this strategy you could play way more aggressive check out this one right here now this is a, of course a playmaking build very fast build and he was pretty close to running circles around me i ain't gonna front with these builds it's way more challenging as i said you could use this strategy with all builds check it out right there i could have got my ankles broke but i did push the right stick up to try to save my ankles right and right here i got him i lined him up really good as soon as he did the size up right here i already know what direction he's going i hit the bump and shove him outside man all right so hopefully this video will help you all out man you already know your boy sim if you're first time to the channel don't forget to like the video share the video and hit your boy subscribe if it's not your first time like the video share the video you never know who's gonna help your boy sim one love respect bless up